Hi guys, just wanted to show you something here. I have to apologize for the bad quality. I I can't screen record, so I had to use the camera, which of course leaves a nasty uh, pattern here on the screen. But I had to show you that. That's really interesting. I mean, first thing is this is the backup and restore from Windows 7 Legacy. I mean, I'm using Windows 10, but I'm using still the Windows 7 built-in backup and restore. You can easily invoke that from the normal backup menu from Windows 10. The thing what I had here, I was trying to make a backup from the C drive to an external hard disk drive. And it never worked. I tried and tried and tried and it never really worked. I had this old external uh, hard drive. Yeah, it's a little bit hard to see. It's an older one, I think about 10 years old or so or close to that. And I mean the hard disk is really working nicely. No problem with that. I have just uh, yeah, a couple of hours ago I've been moving around a, a lot of data from this hard disk drive and it worked perfectly but when I did the backup here, so here you can click on backup now, I mean here you can config to which hard disk drive you want to backup and what you want to uh, backup and then you start it here and after about almost an hour it always came up with this IO error so that was really really annoying I kept trying and trying and it always came back with this IO error and I couldn't figure out what it is so I switched the hard disk drive out and I took a little bit a newer one not much newer maybe one or two years newer a little bit fast a little bit uh, bigger a little bit more space but it's really not much different and both had plenty of free space both has been have been formatted with NTFS so actually absolutely no difference noticeable both with USB 3.0 uh, I couldn't figure out any difference but uh, yeah I thought it's a little bit the faster hard disk drive the newer one so I attached it and started exactly same backup again and it was running fine as you can see here so no problem with that it's blue every time with the old with the other uh, yeah, external hard disk drive it came back with a red uh, indication and said yeah IO error unfortunately there's no history here I cannot show you that but I tried many many times and the first attempt with the new hard disk drive was really successful so if you're using that and you're getting these same IO errors then it is highly advised to try around with different media if you have different hard disk drives try around with them maybe use if you have a large USB stick or whatever you have tried it really could be that problem so it's not uh, where it, the data is coming from so uh, but actually where it's going to so I mean it's not 100% guaranteed that it will always solve the problem but at least it did for me and I hope it will help you too if you are stuck in the same situation and yeah, if you have any questions or comments or other suggestions please write anything down in the feedback area I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time